Today's Gospel Wednesday is taken from St. Luke chapter 7, verses 18 to 23. At that time, John summoned two of his disciples and sent them to the Lord to ask, Are you the one who is to come, or should we look for another? When the men came to him, they said, John the Baptist has sent us to you to ask, Are you the one who is to come, or should we look for another? At that time, he cured many of their diseases, sufferings, and evil spirits. He also granted sight to many who were blind, and he said to them in reply, Go and tell John what you have seen and heard. The blind regain their sight, the lame walk, lepers were are cleansed, the deaf hear, the dead are raised, the poor have the good news proclaimed to them, and blessed is the one who takes no offense at me. The Gospel of the Lord Today's Faithful Reflection is by Sister Kathy Romance of the Hand of the Sower Catholic Community. Doubting? That's fine. In our Gospel today, we have seen that Jesus already proved himself that he is the Messiah, the Son of God, the one who is to come, through miracles. However, people still had to ask. John had to send his disciples to ask Jesus directly if he is really the one they're waiting for. Even if Jesus has already showed us how powerful he is and that he is a miracle worker, we still have doubts and questions, and it's okay. They say good Christians do not doubt because it is the opposite of faith. But I say, there are two sides of it. It can be an enemy of faith, but also a beautiful opportunity for us to have a deeper and stronger faith. Ang pagdududa ay hindi kabaligtaran ng pananampalataya. Ang pagdududa ay isang pagkakataon upang magkaroon ng mas malalim ng pananampalataya. Through those doubts, Jesus patiently reintroduces Himself to us. He introduces Himself not just as a miracle worker, a healer, and a powerful God, but He makes us discover how He is as a best friend, a counselor, and the best listener. Just like John, let us make an effort to go to Him and discover how amazing He'll make Himself known. Let us pray. Jesus, my Lord, may my doubts lead me to a stronger faith in You. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.